the Beard from Metal God TV and I'm with Doug from Saxon. Hi. Hi. Um, you're on stage in a bit. I mean, you've been con seem to be constantly touring. I mean, do, do you guys ever get much of a break? We haven't done for a, oh, three years or something like that. We're on a bit of a break at the moment because we're making an album. So we've had a few months writing, you know, basically just putting, getting ideas together. We, we sort of stopped after the summer, after this last run of festivals and we start again in January. So we're in the studio now, actually. We're, uh, we've just come over today, we're back tomorrow, so we're sort of halfway through drum tracks. And you've played here before, I mean, it's, it's quite yeah. a good venue, isn't it? Yeah, it is, yeah. And uh, you've got an association with Dean Guitars, obviously, with the endorsements yeah. and what have you. How do you, do you mean, how do you like the guitars? Why, why Dean? Ah, they're just nice guitars, you know, good, good good company, you know, and um, I like the Live to Rock guitar a lot. I mean, I like a lot of, I like any guitar player, really. I like, I've got a lot of guitars, you know, they're, I think guitars, a lot of the time, are horses for courses, you, you know, sometimes you want this and sometimes you want that, but uh, the, the, um, the Live to Rock V is a great guitar, it, look, it looks great, it feels, feels really good to play, you know, it's nice. You know. And, have you, and for people who are sort of either wanting a foot on the ladder or learning guitar, I mean, what, what you would say look out for on a guitar? Is it, is it the action or is it the, you know, another thing? I mean, most people go for the look, but it's not always the right thing. No, it definitely isn't. I mean, obviously the action's important. It depends on, you know, some guys have got huge hands, some guys have got small hands, like neck shape and neck size. It's... There's so much personal taste involved with guitars. If you can find a guitar that you love the look of, and you love the the, the way it plays and the sound, you're you're doing all right. You know. <laughs> and uh, what what can we look forward to in the set tonight? Is it is, is it um, the Wheels of Steel album, or are you going to do a bit of all uh, we're sorts? Doing mo uh, we're doing we're doing the kind of summer festival set really. So there's some from the last album, um, mostly the hits, you know, big hits. So. Yeah. And uh, what, what's from here? Have you got a Christmas break or have you got something else to do after this? Uh, well, we're back to the studio tomorrow for another, I don't know, week, maybe a bit more than a week. Then we'll have a break for Christmas and then we're straight back in on January the 3rd or 4th. And have we got a working cycle for the album yet? Uh, not definitely. <laughs> no, no we're, we're playing with a few at the moment, so no, I can't say. No, no problem. Um, and I know you like to do. Um, you have a really good package as Saxon nowadays. You know. Yeah. You know. Uh, as, is there a lot of work going into that at the moment as well? We're not at that stage yet, so I, I again I can't really comment on that. I, it'll be something good. Yeah. You, you know. We're. Uh, We've, we've written quite quickly and, and this time we've approached it slightly differently in that we've, uh, we've done more live recording, like, I don't mean kind of, um, you know, in, in an old, in, you know, we're not going back to a kind of 80s way of recording, but we are actually recording all in the same room for at least initial takes so we get some kind, you know, we, we kind of can retain the energy of the, of the band, which... Uh, Sometimes when you, you know, if you do everything multi-layered, you lose a bit of spontaneity. So uh, people have been saying to us for a while, you should try and get that kind of live energy, yeah. you know, on an album, which is very difficult to do, but we're, we're, we're having a go. Yeah, well, because like you say, if you do it separately, you, re you mo rely more on the, on the mixing side, and if, if it's not quite right, it's not, you don't get the same sound. Yeah, and you've got, you, you know, you lose things like eye contact and, you know, we're, we're basically set up in a quite small area and, uh, you know, we're halfway through the drum tracks. It's going really good, really well, you know, it's got a re very good vibe at the moment. Great stuff. And have you got a date that that might be released yet? Quite soon. <laughs> I, have, I don't have a date. No, 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 no definitely date, but it's yeah. fairly imminent. It's it's be going, after Christmas, quick. yeah? Yeah, oh yeah, definitely. Yeah. Yeah. Great stuff, so we can uh, be expecting Saxon to be touring next year, promoting the new album yeah. and up and down the country, and hopefully a good festival as well. Yeah, yeah, I mean, have a look at the website, it's already pretty full, you know. I think we, uh, we're back in the studio on the 4th, and then we go to America on the 21st, then we're back in the studio as soon as we get back from America, and then we're in Australia, and then I think after that the, the uh, European tour starts, so... And is there any country that Saxon still 
haven't made inroads to yet. I mean, you've probably been I've probably been everywhere in the world, but is there somewhere that you think you could make inroads to? Um, I think we. I guess we haven't been to China and, and the East very, very much. You know, but there hasn't really been an opening or a market there specifically before that I know of. You know, but I know, I know bands are going there now. So, yeah, there seems to be a big influx of people yeah. to Japan for some reason. Yeah, I mean everywhere else, like you know, South America, Japan, um, obviously all Europe. Most of the planet, actually, most of the planet. But the east is a, is a is an area that we've not really been too much. So all we can say now is keep it metal, keep it dean, check out Saxon, because they absolutely rock. See you on tour. <laughs> Thank you very much, Doug.